Okay, so that's all hooked up to what that, what's that white thing? Um, that's just a compression tube, it's a kind of compression tube that goes back up to the vacuum. Up here, and pretty much that's the vacuum. That's what actually creates the suction, and that just is the pump. This thing right here. I can actually attach this. Oh, they were just kissing. So is there some food there for them that they just want to eat? There's some left over from yesterday, but yeah, I'll get some brain. Is that why they stick their heads in those <laughs> traps? Okay. I just bring her in to keep her used to the routine so I don't have to break her back into it. And then I just use hot water and a rag to rinse or to clean off any manure or dirt or anything off of her flowers. They mostly just get dirty with them laying down and stuff? Yeah, laying down, they walk through the swamp a lot and they just get covered in mud. Oh yeah, they go into the water and right. Yeah. So does this happen every day? Yep. Really, I should be doing it twice a day, but um, we don't really have anywhere for the milk to go, so we have to kind of scale the production back a bit.
hand milking a shot? I would love to. I don't have a clue what I'm doing. Alright, I don't know if my hands need to be cleaned at all. I'm just carrying it off. so that it comes out. why we like the automatic filter. <laughs> this does take a while. Time-wise, uh, what's the comparison? Just me, I'd have to, because she, you know, she has four quarters. That's what we call them. They're all separate quarters, each team. So you have to do two at a time. And it would probably take me about 20 minutes to count as opposed to the milkers 10 or 8 sometimes, depending on how much they have. Do you just run it and you flip a switch? Yep. Switch, hook it up. Will we see that as well today or is oh, yeah. it hand milking only? Okay, we'll see both. Hey, you made it for the milking.